Viewer discretion. Welcome back, guys. Right. It's Stockholm Tiger here, and uh, let's jump back into it, shall we? Here we go. Previously on The Walking Dead. No, I'm just joking. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, should we? Uh, let's take this one as well. Let me know that we got loads of food for them. Should we talk to this little? Should we give food? Let's see what happens. It's not much, but here. You sure? Yeah, you're under quite a bit of stress. Thanks. That's uh, really sweet. Don't oh yeah. <laughs> How's he doing? I'm not sure I got your name. It's Lee. Lily. My dad's Larry. I was just doing what I had to earlier. Everyone was. Now his heart's acting up again and I'm powerless to do anything. And that violence before with my dad, that didn't help. Hey. You're from here? Go fucking blame us for it. The Air Force base. Yeah, I know it. Pilot? Nah, just mechanical admin stuff. I deal with a bunch of shitheads and bureaucrats all day. Sometimes a plane, if I'm lucky. You? I work up at UGA. Uh... Was anyone here when you guys got here? No, this place was pretty wrecked. We pulled a couple of bodies out of the office. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Yeah, the mud. Do you know anybody have here? Been his parents. Yeah, the owners. They were. Uh, we were close. I'm sorry. We found an older couple in the office. Dad hauled them out in case they weren't really dead. What do you think about all this? What is there to think? The dead are up, walking around, eating people, and turning them into more more of them I mean Jesus we need to stick together and get through this what's wrong with him he's got a heart condition he takes nitroglycerin tablets pretty regularly I've seen a few bad attacks that he couldn't get over and needed to go to the hospital yeah that's uh, not really an option right now I'm just trying to keep him relaxed he's got a temper Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't know. It's just that... Yeah? Uh... Should we... Should we do it? Yeah. We've got kids here. Family. He and I are a family. I'm just saying some people can't handle a temper like that. Hell, that it seems like you can. It's just his way. Don't make him the reason everything's screwed. And I think we're gonna stop talking. Where's her mom? Savannah, I think. Oh, you guys aren't together. Oh, uh, no, I'm not her dad. I found her in a house when getting out of Atlanta. She'd been surviving by herself. I think the girl's parents didn't make it. Oh. I heard an answering message. They were in Savannah. She was home with a sitter. It wasn't good. Well, she's lucky to have you. I'm gonna get back oh, to you. You can have me as well so if you like. Uh-huh. You know what I'm saying? Alright, I need to go to the back office. Try to get some rest. Get this fucking How can food I to this kid? Those things out there? It's not much, but here. For the boy. Oh, thanks, Lee. He appreciates it. That's sweet, Lee. <laughs> Ice cream menus. No, I'm good. Hey, Lee. You really gave that old man hell. Yeah. We got pushed, you know? You don't have to tell me. I was ready to tear the man's sure head you were. Anyway, we, Kat and I, appreciate your support. Thank you, Lee. Uh, how's Duck doing? I guess are uh, What's the plan? How's Duck doing? He's okay. It was just a shock. We're lucky as hell. Nobody Man, I want to see if he's here. been bit or not. How is she doing? Because if he's bit, I'm going to off him. Straight away. How should I know? She's good, I think. Her family's dead. Uh... She's good, I think. She's a tough one right there. She's just a little girl, Ken. What are you saying, Lee? She spent days surviving on her own? That's right. 
Not just any little girl can do that. What's the plan? Hang tight, I suppose. Seems pretty dangerous out there, so we ought to wait for things to clear up. Who will so you someone's outside was shooting us out once before? That's right. Where are they? Should we go oh, looking you're for here them? Now. They're gone, I don't know. They're on this place. They uh, own this place. They uh, pulled some bodies out of the office before we got here. They're uh, gone. Oh, sweetie. Cat. They were good people. I wasn't around much, but yeah, they're dead. Are you guys all right? Oh, we're just fine, considering. How about you, Duck? We've all been through a lot. Lee, you got a second? Sure. Back on Herschel's farm. Yeah. Hey, you're pushed up, man. I'm panicked, you know. I'm not proud of it. Should I? Should I? Should I? No. Nah. I guess. But I can't stop seeing him in my head. Damn it. I should have took the other, uh, other option. I killed that boy. We could have saved him together. You didn't have a choice. You think you do when you look back on it. But in a moment, when things are really out of control, you don't have any choice. I guess. Is that pussy though? Trying to let it go. Man, I'm not even looking for fucking getting his loyalty. I'm just ending up getting get it. Get, 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 Okay, you talk to everyone if you talk to them. Do I want to see that? Oh, should I give her food? Uh, yeah, what the hell? Here, I've been finding some stuff to eat. Oh, um, uh, thanks. You're welcome. Are you sure your girl doesn't need it? She's good. I've been trying to keep her fed and watered. You're a good caretaker. Thanks. So... You're a pretty good shot. Going often? Well, you don't fuck with a reporter. Especially one that's three days out from her last cup yeah, of coffee. <laughs> what are you messing around with there? A radio. I can't get it to work, though. Here. Let me have a look. Uh, volume. Flip it over. Battery. Antenna. Uh, Daha. There are no batteries in this thing. What? <laughs> You know that there are no batteries in that. Thing. Yeah, of course. I, I mean, yeah. No. I can try <laughs> to find some. Needs two. Oh my Thanks. God! I wouldn't even really know what to look for. Really? Come on. All right. Let, yeah. Let's get in this back office now and see what happens. Alive inside? No, apparently not. Ooh, there's loads of blood, dude. I can't. I can't think about them in here. Alright, there's some first aid thingies. This door leads to the back alley. Okay, that could be good to know. When shit hit the fan. Do not want to talk to you. There's the first aid kit. What's up here? Nothing up there. What? Is this the first aid kit? Yeah. Yep. Examine bedding. Our parents came in here hoping to survive. But it looks like one of them was her. I wonder if it was my dad. <laughs> Trying to be a hero, maybe. Or protect her, at least. Uh, photo? There's a photo over there. Yeah. Pick it up. There he is. And our brother worked at the hospital. Mm. Alright. 
find anything? It's a photo of the family who owned this place. Might help us track down the keys to the office. I know who you are. You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to uh -oh. that job. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? The world has ended out there. Who cares who I am? If you don't think people will find any reason to turn on you, especially when the shit hits the fan, you're insane. Whatever. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and... Look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good, because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group... Oh, fuck off. I hear you. I'll just keep it to myself. Hey, you better. I don't trust you. How can I trust you? Thanks. Duh. Which one? Which one? Ah. How can I trust you? You can't, I suppose. But you don't have many other options. Son of a bitch. This was my dad's cane. He'd zip around here on it from time to time. Was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. <laughs> this cane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. Plus, he knew how to make it look cool. Like you and your hat. My dad gave it to me. See, dads are smart like that. Look at the door. No, thank you. Desk. I ought to clear a path to opening that door. Alright. Nothing particular here. Let's take this first aid kit, man. Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. How's that gonna be lucky? The first aid kit. They tell me there's nothing in there. Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. Man, how's, how can that be luck? Let's see if she said anything. Everyone out there seem alright to you? Yeah. Well, maybe not the sick guy. Yeah. We'll keep an eye on him. There was that thing in the bathroom. It tried to get me. I know. But you stopped it. Yeah, I did. Can you do that more? Well, I'm not gonna go looking for her. I mean, get the dangerous ones. I'm gonna try. Good. Have you heard from Glenn? Not in a little while. I'm gonna keep looking around. Okay. <laughs> Better get this door clear, huh? Can I help? Sure. Here we go. Watch your fingers in the drawers. <sighs> Things have been scary, huh? Yeah. It's not good. I don't know why everyone is crazy. Neither do I, Clementine. Nobody does, I don't think. I bet my dad does. No. Okay, here we go. <sighs> Do you have kids? No. You don't have a family? 